day one of this stupid ass lockdown. Uh, I just think that I should have just took them two weeks off. Sat in the house, watched Christmas movies every day with Pringles and dip and just chilled to the max. Instead, like the last time we shut down, it was a matter of have a serious look at what needs done in the gym because it is valuable time to get stuff done um, and that's exactly what we've done since we knew we were going to close um, I suppose mentally it's a good thing for me and um, you know that you can refocus your energy on something else um, I think mentally it's, it's a very positive thing you know uh, taking the worst out of a bad situation type of thing um, I just went, here he comes. I'm so tired and I can't be arsed and wait you see how happy he is. He just did not be on his own. Right. Oh, that's right. I, I, I don't even know it's on camera. <laughs> you can tell by how quickly he accepted that Red Bull. Oh, class. <laughs> yes, instead of sitting at home eating mince pies and watching Christmas movies for the next two weeks. Sad face. That, no. That'd be <laughs> awesome. But imagine if you could get away with doing that. Just sit at home, right? See, see if I was at home today, right? And just sit and chilling out. My first day would be Santa Claus 1, 2, and 3. No way. And I would go to Centre and I would buy a, um, an advent calendar and eat the whole fucking thing in one day. Do you know what's so fly? Yeah. I seen some, or uh, my mum bought my brother an advent calendar with a Reese's bar, a different Reese's bar on it every day of the year or uh, day of the month. Oh, that'd be nice. I might buy myself one. This isn't bad, you know. Do you know if I was to get any advent calendar, you know what I'd want? The Lindor ones. <sighs> so you get a ball every day? Oh, yes. That you think of the piss you used to eat as a wee boy. Have you, you Stuff can't... like fucking dog treats, with <laughs> tiny chocolates that you would give to a dog. You can't, you can't chew them, but you hate to suck them. My allergies are fucked. So yes, we're going to actually be productive over these two weeks. Big shout out to anybody who's watching this here who isn't a member of Inspire Gym. If every time you go into a lockdown and your gym doesn't do something amazing to make the gym better, change fucking gyms. Because... <laughs> The last lockdown was four months, and apparently some gyms opened up the same way they shut down, and they got bloody grants and support and all the rest of it. So, personally, I think if that's your gym, get the fuck out of your gym. Because, oh, this is for. I had to bleep that out. <laughs> There'll probably be a lot of bleeping through this day. Oh, God. oh my god. So, yes, first day off the gym, first day of lockdown, and me and Jimbo were up. I'm Daddy Bear. Or, <laughs> that's a whole different meaning you don't even know about <laughs> <laughs> we're up but this is going to end up being a very strong video if we keep going like this it has to be professional it's for the gym page but technically we're off work so fuck it <laughs> the, um, so yes get to my point eventually um, we're going to do we're actually working we're trying to make the gym better we've got a few projects to take on today we have to go shopping we're going to pick up a machine, new machine for the gym. I had to go to B&Q, I had to go to IKEA, I had to go to all the places that um, are essential to be open and um, that gyms aren't. So, I imagine like uh, garden centres. Mate, don't talk to me. See, last night I was fit to be hung. I was sick in the, to the back teeth last night. But the amount of places that were able to stay open and we were told by environmental health we that you sure. can't do anything. You can't even, like what we're doing right now, apparently is against the law, but oh, yeah. you're my employee, so fuck it. Yeah, but we haven't left each other for like... I know, months. but you're, you're not even allowed to meet your friend to go for a walk under these new laws. Uh, but you can, who's these fuckers at the gym? The gym's fucking closed. Oh, that's... Um... Oh, it's next door. All right, stay tuned.
a good sleep? Oh yes, um, <laughs> fully. fully Charging it. Are we going to Burger Van? I believe so. <laughs> you're not allowed to start a burger van. Why? Because! If you're getting one, I'm getting one. Never take. I thought I was going to push my arm. No, man. You push the trolley. I'll push the trolley. You want to push the trolley, son? You push the trolley. There's a couple of arms off him, it's not. Look at that. That's just what Jordy needs there. Hey, Jordy! Cancun? Or not Cancun? Caracas. Who? Caracas. Is that light a wee bit lighter than Hamilton? Tijuana, that looks nice. Laughing all the way. I always wanted for my daddy. Actually, you should have been buying them when he was younger. <laughs> <laughs> you can take that home off you. <laughs> this is why I wanted to kill the Aftermath dog. <laughs> <laughs> For the gym, when we turned up there uh, to look at it, it just wasn't, it just wasn't right, it just wasn't for us. We went then and um, headed to B and Q in IKEA um, for the next thing that we're working on in the gym during lockdown, um, and that is doing up our male changing rooms and giving them a complete and utter revamp. To be honest, um, hand on my heart, when it came to building the place, um, towards the end we got pushed for time and it was a rush and it was. It was a, a that'll do type of thing. We never put the, the time and concentration into it, um, to the male changing rooms, the way we have done the female changing rooms. And um, it's something that has annoyed me. It's like fucking really pissed me off for so long. So it's got completely stripped out, um, completely redesigned, and a whole new look and a whole new feel to the place. So our fun on the day out to IKEA and B&Q, when I'm running around trying to get things sorted and stressing and trying to figure stuff out. Jordi and my dad, on the other hand, seem to have a great time. Oh shit, I'm sorry. Christmas before I go back in touch. 
I found it, but I had no brakes, couldn't keep it cool. With loads of power, I was behind an hour, so I gave them pump a screw. Out all night, waiting no lights, only seeing stars, and gleam from the moon, and the diesel light in the dash. Mowing, lifting, sewing, bailing, drawing, hauling, number breaking, back and stacking, plowing, crashing, tipping, wrapping, tail doors flop, sucking diesel, cutting, trucking, spreading, piping, double touching, spailing, sliding, digging, breaking, wearing, tearing, losing weight. Oh, it's a dip and burn, that she goes all the way. When I'm flat to the mat with the party hat, some men in four that's in. Well, the thought that we were quick, well, when the sun went down, with a flame from the pipe. He's lost his trolley. <laughs> he lost his trolley. <laughs> I've found the trolley now. Fuck. We didn't want shopping for this. So much trolley. So much Monday. <laughs> And new teeth for digging the nose and in muck. In case it rains, need an old chain lying in the truck. Climbing, liming, mixing, piping after the field is cut. There's many to gap you won't get at without 6,000 foot. 